welcome back to the channel welcome back to the vlog from the great sunshine state of florida it's a little overcast and cloudy today so not much sunshine from the sunshine state you see it my freedom shirt yesterday was a uh, veteran day happy veterans day to all the veterans past and present i guess past and present um yeah as i usually say freedom is not free but welcome to another tool time thursday and today we're going to be going over uh something a little bit different as you know i always pick other stuff other than tools all the time but if this is your first time checking out the channel please hit that subscribe button down below hit the bell icon ding, for future uploads give me a thumbs up like share and definitely comment on the video um yeah let's get to today's video these gnats are driving me crazy so today's tool time thursday is actually a helper tool to help me load the car up on the trailer for when i uh, go to different race events um if you guys had known i went back and changed took the air system off went back to uh static spring because i'm gonna start competitively race this uh car it's a manual m6 and i'm trying to get down into the low nines in a manual um hellcat so with this it actually helps me load up for the track every time so as you guys can see how low my car sits off the ground because i have this additional um, down floor solution splitter that lights up um, so it you know take that much more off of it these are the same springs that i had on my car before i put the airbags on um, and then of course i have the drag wheels on it so if you look from the side look how low that is to the ground so with a trailer of course it would be a nightmare trying to get my car loaded up on the trailer with 16 million different um blocks of wood so i reached out to a company um spoke with them american made company and as you can see race ramps so this is their long version and just so you know this part you can see i've been using it this actually sits right up underneath my trailer. So I don't even have to use the ramps that came with the trailer. And I'll insert a pic because my trailer isn't here, but I have a picture of the car on the trailer. So let me show you um, which one this is. I'll put the part number in the description and I'll also give you the price. But what I like about this one is, look how low it comes down to a point where I could eventually drive the car all the way up onto the trailer without having to put different pieces of wood. It starts, as you can see right here, it starts really low, gradually goes up. And as you can see with the splitter, how low it is, it doesn't even touch. So by the time it gets here, in order for it to get right here, the wheel is already up, so it already lifts the car up and I'm able to drive the trailer up pretty easily on the, on the, I mean, drive the car up easily on the trailer. It comes in two pieces right there because it, it needs to be so long because you have to do like a calculation um, for your trailer height and how low your car is. And they have a calculator on their website to where you calculate and it'll tell you which one they recommend for your car height and also for your trailer height. So yeah, if you go to raceramps.com, that will also help you with that. And look at there. I just take it apart and I put it in the back of my truck, take it to the track. Has these nice, easy carrying handles, which actually is lighter than what I thought it was going to be. So when I'm not using them, I have them stacked up like this in my garage. So they just stack on each other and gives you a nice, um, a nice thick, a nice platform. So it's, um, I wouldn't say it folded up, but it goes to where you could just stack them up out of the way. You could do them like this horizontally, or you could do them vertically if you have the space. And let me show you guys. Upside down, pretty lightweight. Put it there. And if you look at this right here, 
1500 pounds max on one so it could handle the weight of the car because it's dispersed across the two and then of course these are laying flat on the ground and i said it's pretty um it's pretty they're pretty light and they're 100 percent made in the us of a so with it just load the car up and then all i do is i just lift this up pretty light out of the way and then what i do i grab this part then i just grab it like this this is also 1500 pounds and this is how light it is like one hand and it's off the ground so it's not heavy as my it's not heavy as my ramps my actual these are lighter than a five foot metal ramps that's on my trailer so these come in super handy and of course i've listed um i'll put the race ramp um instagram and their uh website in the description below and i said they're pretty good the prices are great i believe and it helps me load the car up so much easier and as you can see it doesn't touch so as the car comes up you know it's gonna come up and then to where it goes up on the trailer no problem so that's how it looks right there and like i say if you go down look you can see underneath the footer so you know once it hits the the tire it'll go up and then just drives right up on the ramp or as low as the car um as low as the car sits but again thanks race ramps um great american company um i like the product a lot of people use their products all the wrap shops use their products they also have other products that you could use to wear you know it helps you instead of using jack stands it's just awesome so as i said great product Ooh, look at that the car look good outside today don't it but that's just our quick tool time thursday video again thanks for checking out the channel definitely hit the subscribe button down below bell icon thumbs up go check out race ramps and um yeah thanks for watching the videos until the next tool time thursday guys I don't know what sleepers, I got a queen, she lit me the evening, she ripe like a peach and she snapped me the snippet. You well overdue for that link up in person. Text me to fall through a smurder, she wrote it. Still up with courage, you're doing the service. Pull up to the crib, I'm equipped with the brush strokes. Cut throat from the low, low, when no love goes. Women buddy.